anything that is not windowed mode. And don't steal shit. True. Don't steal shit. Uh, but yeah. So we do have one more thing that we need to do this stream. And it is very epic, I assure you. I need to I need to sell out for an hour. Cause uh there was a Twitch bounty for WWE 2K24. And um I'm a big I don't know if you know this about me, but I'm actually a big WWE fan. So usually when Twitch offer me like sponsors and stuff, I'm not really too bothered because they're like games that I'm not really particularly interested in. Or, you know, games that I've never touched or whatever. So I'm not going to pretend to you like, oh, yeah, I love this game that I've never played before. Um, but WWE 2K24, I've been watching WWE since like 2002. Like, I don't watch it as much anymore, but I used to watch it a ton growing up. So I fucking love wrestling. WWE and UFC, I watch that shit all the time. Uh, so, yeah, if I go manage bounties, we have one for WWE 2K24. How exciting is that? So if you're just here for um, GTA, that's completely fine. No worries. Uh, I will see you on the next stream. We'll be back to GTA as normal. And we might even play the new casual game, which has been voted on by the community. Uh, so we've still got Half-Life DLC to play as well. And then we might play some Bully, which was the next voted one. Um, but yeah, we'll do... I need to set a title. WWE... Wait, my caps lock is on. Checking out WWE... 2k24 uh you have to put like ad right i'm pretty sure that's like a legal requirement now ad start done nice cool uh, and they actually gave me a free copy on steam which is very nice as well uh it's really nice when the devs do that because if they want me to check it out then you know i don't have to pay like 70 quid for their game which is very nice have I played any of the recent WWE 2K games before? I haven't. So I played a ton of the early wrestling games when I was younger. I played like SmackDown 2, Know Your Role. I played all the um, like WWE No Mercy and all that kind of shit. And I played um, the SmackDown vs. Raw games from 2005 to 2011, I want to say. I don't remember how many there were. But yeah, like I love those games. Those are awesome. So I'm hoping that this game has like a similar thing where it's like some kind of career mode or something. Oh, it has an update on Steam. I need to update it. Hold on. Here Comes the Pain is also a great one. Yeah. There's like Shut Your Mouth, Here Comes the Pain, Know Your Role, and a couple of other ones. Yeah. Yeah, SmackDown vs. Raw soundtrack. I have so many songs on my playlist that I learned from SmackDown vs. Raw. My, wh one of my favorite songs ever, which is Survived by Rise Against, was on um, SmackDown vs. Raw. I don't remember which one. I want to say 2006 or 5. Yeah, I love that shit, dude. So I'm actually excited to uh, get a game that I actually know about and can actually talk about, which is nice. I also heard um, regarding the new 2K games is like recently, I don't know if it's before 2K took over or after or during, I don't know, um, but WWE games became like a yearly release and they didn't really innovate much. But then apparently they stopped doing that and they came back to the drawing board and actually made some good changes with this year's game. So it's been reviewed a lot better um, than the ones before that were just like yearly sports releases that like, you know didn't have a lot of effort put into them. All right, we're booting it up now. Grab a controller. This game needs a controller for the best experience. So grab an Xbox controller, a DualSense. Oh, I haven't seen this before. Uh, I have a controller somewhere. Hold on, I'll boot the game up and then I'll go and grab a controller because I don't want to destroy your ears potentially. Oh, it booted on my other screen. Fuck's sake. Okay. I would appreciate it if you booted on my main monitor game. <laughs> At least I can turn it down. Important health warning. Read before playing. Okay. I can't capture it until it's on my other screen. Press any button. Okay. Don't try this at home, school, or anywhere. Yes, yes, yes. Let me switch monitors. 
I'm skipping through the intros. Press any button. I can't hear the game at all. Online user, do I really have to read this? I have to read the end user license agreement, bro. Go back. Yep, I'm definitely reading these things. You agree to these terms, yes. Create or link an existing 2K account. Do I need a 2K account? To access my faction, enable cross-platform and unlock 1500 of this currency. Can I just not do this? Close. Okay, I cannot do this. Good. Oh, welcome to 2K24. Uh, do I go to the performance center? No, skip to the main menu. I want to change my settings, please. Thank you for purchasing it, Supercharger. I think that's DLC. Bro, let me go to the main menu. Main menu, season pass, nightmare pack. Oh my god, there's so much DLC that includes um, that's included. Okay, finally, we're at the menu. Page up and page down. Options. They're not store. Um, is there no option to change like actual stuff? There's store roster. Extras, Jukebox, Audio Volume, Performance Center, Gameplay Controls. Where's the video options? Gameplay? No? No way there's just no video options. I legit can't see my chat. I can't see anything. Extras? Graphic settings. Why is that in extras? It should just be in options. Monitor, one, two. Space accept. There we go. I can see everything now. Okay, windowed mode, yes. I can actually capture it for you now. Yeah. I, I don't want to accept a million different things and go into 700 menus before I go to the fucking main menu, dude. And yeah, let me change so I can boot onto the actual menu. Like, I'm supposed to be streaming this for you all, and you can't even see my first impression with the game because I can't capture it because of the fact that it doesn't let me go into the menu. Now I can capture it for you. Goodness me. Uh, game capture. Yes. Uh, specific window. WWE 2K24. There we go, now you can see it. Uh, let's put it down here. There we go. You can finally see the game. Right, let me set my options. 1920 by 1080. Uh, windowed mode, so I'll stick it in 1600 by 900. V-Sync, sure. Action camera, sure, whatever. Texture quality, standard. Oh, I can choose borderless. Can I? Choose which monitor to use for borderless full screen. Windowed mode. Wait, what? Is it in... Is it in Borderless by default? I think it's in Borderless by default, but it's... There should be an option to go exclusive full screen, Borderless full screen, or windowed. Okay, I'm not gonna go through these for I'm gonna turn motion blur off. Texture quality standard or high? High, I guess? I'll put it in window. No, don't want windowed. Okay, it is in borderless by default. Good. Borderless I can handle. Exclusive full screens? No. Uh, but yeah, this is what I was going to. I went to options, and then I wasn't able to actually fucking find the options, but it's in extras, then graphic settings. Yeah. Very strange. Uh, let me turn the game down a bit, because it's kind of loud. And then we'll actually, we'll actually play... <laughs> Okay, should be a bit more reasonable volume now. Oh, I need to go and get a controller as well. Right, be right back. Getting a controller.
Xbox controller. We're in it. All right. So I'm gonna go to. Gonna go to the performance center because I haven't played one of these games in like 15 years. And I imagine all of the gameplay mechanics are all very different. Controller is plugged in. Is Vince in this game? That's a good question. I did hear about the Vince McMahon stuff. Kind of gross, not gonna lie. But he should have been out the company a long time ago. Vince is, is well past it. Let's be honest. Like, even before all the allegations stuff. Uh, if you guys aren't familiar with WWE, the, the, the chairman of WWE, who's like a, what, like an 80-year-old man, uh, recently got outed for like a load of gross, like, sexual assault uh, charges and stuff. Really grim. But he should have been long gone. Should have been long gone. I heard he's censored in the showcase. What, not even removed, just straight up censored? That's 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 brilliant. Okay, performance center. Let, let's learn how to play the game. Hey guys, Gabby Kelly here, and I am so excited to talk to you more about the new training feature. I can't hear you. The performance center. Now, just like the performance center in Orlando. The game was really loud, and now it's really quiet. Superstars to learn the most important gameplay techniques we go. you'll need to level up your game. Inside each lesson, use what you learn to complete objectives and show that you have mastered the material. Hi, Kathy Kelly. Now, I'm being joined by Drew Gulak. Uh, Drew, I don't know who this guy is. Since we've seen you, ever since I haven't watched WWE in a while. The face of the tutorial last year. Have you actually seen him anywhere? Why don't you check my GM mode, Kathy? Woods might have gotten his 15 minutes of fame as the host last year, and hey, good for him, he did a fine job. But let's not forget, I've been involved with the tutorial for the last two years. Wait, didn't Xavier actually throw you over the top Xavier? of your appearance in the game last year? <laughs> <laughs> well, the past that is not how you pronounce his name, bro. Now, Kathy, the fact remains that whether it's in the ring or with the controller, I am unquestionably the expert when it comes to teaching the fundamentals of professional wrestling. Why is the other person's face censored in that cutscene? Approved for the performance center. So if you want to become Do they like not work for the company anymore so they didn't want to put them in? Now it's time to lace up those boots, Greenhorn. Pick a lesson to get started. All right. You heard him. Time to hit the ropes and good luck. Good indie wrestler who did nothing in WWE like most of them. Kathy, luck is for losers. Success is what happens when preparation meets opportunity. This opportunity is knocking on the door. Now it's time to see whether you've got the skills. Yo, James, welcome. Counts. Okay. We got what looks to be like Roman Reigns and Cody Rhodes, I think. Yeah, let's play all. Play all of them. Yes. <laughs> Teach me how to play. Basic attacks. Press X to light attack and A to heavy attack. Light attacks are great for stunning your opponent and interrupting the defender. Heavy attacks are great for dealing damage and usually knock your opponent down. Grapples B are great for dealing a lot of damage or repositioning your opponent. Perform a right or a light or heavy grapple attack by pressing B then X or A. Okay. Our first order of business is to master the basics. Practice, practice. Oh my god, I can't talk. Practice hitting light and heavy attacks on Xavier Woods before moving on to some light and heavy grapple attacks. Okay. Who am I playing as? Drew Gulak. Heavy attack. All right, nice little clothesline. Pretty good, pretty good. Light attack. Little chop. Overhand. All right, all right. Get your ass up. Big. Uh, light grapple. Press B. Alright. This guy's a clothesline master. Your dude looks just like you. True. I actually am that jacked IRL. Alright. Whoa, a pin as well? I don't think I've ever seen a, a slam like that into a pin. This guy's nuts.
All right, nice little front suplex. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Yo, Vixenio, welcome. I got WWE 25 Giga Coins. Let's go, dude. I can't believe you're actually playing this tutorial. To be fair, I probably should just like play the uh, play the thing because this tutorial is probably going to take me like an hour. Should we just uh, skip the tutorial and just go and play like the uh, the what's it called? Like the the you know the I don't know like the career mode or whatever. Perform a knife edge chop. Ow! I'm getting beaten up. Let's go and do the career mode. This is going to take forever. And we only have an hour. Yeah, there's so many of them. Oh, look, yeah, look at this. This would have taken legit forever. Let's go. Straight into my career or whatever. Is it my faction? Universe? My GM? Oh, no, my rise. This is probably the, like, my rise to... To stardom. Before a legend. Before a superstar. Hey, look, it's Steve Austin. Before Somebody asked for him earlier. Hey, look, it's Rhea Ripley. Somebody asked for her earlier too. A record-breaking run. A jaw-dropping turn. I mean, that wasn't really a jaw-dropping turn when it happened. Possibility, an opportunity to step outside of yourself and to step into something greater. Whether it's proving to the doubters that you have what it takes. Is this me? I'm doing the work. Or proving to yourself that you know who you are. Where's Hulk Hogan? Hulk Hogan got cancelled like 10 years ago for being a horrific racist. He's a proper dickhead. You have to begin. And make it your own from who you are. To the choices you make along the way. And replace possibility with legend. Because this, this is your story. This is my story. Where's Dwayne? Isn't he the main one? Funnily enough, Dwayne is like legit going to be in the WrestleMania main event, even though he hasn't wrestled like actively in like 20 years. Between this year's two unique My Rise stories, Undisputed and Unleashed, there are 10 slave save slots available. Both Undisputed and Unleashed have pivotal choices that can send you down distinct pathways, with their own characters, arenas, and clothing parts to unlock. Try playing each story multiple times to experience different outcomes. Okay. Are they going to re revoke your Steam copy? No, they let you keep the game. It would be kind of shitty if you only got to borrow it for an hour. Don't forget, you can. I need to turn the music down. Like, the rest of the game is so not loud, but. Don't forget, you can also import a create a superstar. Oh, so I need to make a superstar first. Okay, one sec. I need to go and make a superstar. Creations. Like, let me turn down the... Let me turn down the music. The music is so loud. Here we go. Create a superstar. New custom superstar. Create your superstar. Yo, that's basically me. Can't make my own? Wait, there's a remove clothing button. Yo. That's hot. Apply clothing, remove clothing. Okay. Is this like my base? Who looks the most like me? That kind of looks like me. <laughs> With the hair and everything. Oh, this guy's like default, so we can we can we, we can use him as a base. You can randomize the superstar's entire body within seconds. I can't let's see what the randomize looks like. Random. Yo, this guy looks kind of clean. Let's just randomize and see if we can get anything good. <laughs> yeah, so these look pretty good. Oh, yo, that is me because I'm so tall. That, that's a good start. Face. 
Face template. No, let's uh, let's modify me. Face texture. Um, well, I'm super white, like as white as can be. Yeah, there you go. That's me. Sample colors? No, this is perfect. That's like my basically my skin color. Skin color? Yep. Facial parts. Skin color. Teeth. Uh, I'm British, so that's what my teeth looked like. Uh, material? Material of teeth? Various materials in types of different fabrics and metallic materials? What? First material? Cloth? What, of my teeth? Vinyl. Sure, I've got vinyl teeth. They're now shape. They're now glowing. Uh, plastic. Sure. That those are my teeth. My teeth are vinyl and plastic. Absolutely. Yep. You can remove certain teeth from your superstar. <laughs> what the fuck? You can just get rid of certain teeth. <laughs> this is very in-depth. Yep, that, that's pretty much how I look, yeah. That's that's how a that's how a Brexit geezer looks. Got the teeth. Blemishes. Uh I don't really have any scars. My skin's kind of good. I like God of War if I have this. Just have the two up top like a beaver. What, just like the two buck teeth? Which ones are the two buck teeth ones? One and two? There you go. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Okay, we don't have any wrinkles because I'm young. Face deformation. I definitely have some of those. Detail adjustments can be performed on face parts. Okay. Facial region. Yeah, that's definitely deformed. Uh, How do I do this? Oh, I can just like... I can just like drag everything. This is like impressive how... Uh, how how different this is. Yeah, like you can grab like the individual parts of the eyebrows look and just move them. It, it is very in depth. Yeah, that's pretty much how my, how my eyebrows look. And then my eyes, they like, they're like this. He smelled what the rock was cooking, true. Yeah, like that. And then my nose is like... Yeah, big schnozzer. That goes like, yeah, like that. He's looks maxing. <laughs> true. I'm actually mewing right now, IRL. You have no idea. That is exactly how my nose looks IRL. Lips? Yeah, they're like down here. Perfect. That's exactly how I look. Facial structure? Oh my god, there's so many of these. Earlobes, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much how they look, yeah. Forehead, massive. Colossal forehead. You can't even see it. It, just, it doesn't even change. Forehead, size, massive. Uh, nose, huge. Yeah. Yep. Yep. There we go. Nose bridge, also huge. Yep. Nose tip. 
Colossal. Absolutely massive. There we go. Nostrils, the biggest you've ever seen. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. What is a philtrum? I know what I'm changing here. Oh, it's like below your nose. Yeah, massive. Jawline chiseled. I have a really chiseled jawline. Yeah, like that. Yep. 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 Exactly. That's exactly how I look. Uh, anything else? Head size? Just massive in general. Yeah. I look sick. He is? Yeah, pretty big. <laughs> there we go. Much better. Way lower. Yeah, that's better. There we go. Now, that's perfect. I look so good. Face photo capture. Wait, no way it can actually use... You could employ... <laughs> <laughs> you can apply an imported face photo on the custom superstar's face. After selecting the photo, you can line up the face. Wait, hold on. I can download one. Can I upload one? These are just like random people, right? How do I put my own face on? What the fuck is this? No, how do I put my own face on? You can upload your own face. How? <laughs> Gotta go to WWE community. Oh shit, okay. We can do that later. Okay, we're all good. This is exactly how our face looks. You have to use a website or app? Oh shit, okay. Body. Body type and weight class? I am an absolute unit, so we're gonna have to move this up a bit. Uh, medium? No, no, no. I'm seven foot on a, on a good day. Weight? 600 pounds. Yeah, seven foot, 600. That sounds about right, yeah. Making a superstar taller than 6'7"? Okay. Uh, yes, I want to change. Okay. Dude, that is exactly how I look right there. You see that one on the bottom, right? This. That's exactly how I look. There we go. That's me. Yes. Yo, Rob Swede, thank you for the prime. Attire? I mean, we're pretty, we're pretty close already. This looks pretty good. Edit attire. Uh, clothing. Upper body. Actually, I want to get rid of this ugly ass whatever he has on his head, like a bandana. Caps. Yeah, don't be so ridiculous. Oh, crown? Say less. That's mine. Color? First color? Gold. There we go. Because I'm a king. King Eben. Let's go. <laughs> Perfect. Upper body. Tops. Remove all this. Get, take all this crap off. Okay. Tops. Honestly, I don't know if I want a top. Because I kind of just look really good already, you know? What do you guys think? Oh, yo, business on the top? Yo. Business on the top? Party in the back, or whatever they say. Yeah, I kind of like that. A referee's shirt? John Cena. I'm going to be John Cena's biggest fan. UK Yokozuna looking ass? That's so toxic. Oh, yo, that's kind of good on me. Oh, yes. With, with the belly button showing as well? Yes. Perfect. Looks like someone from Driffield on the train to Hull. True. Uh, let's get something on the hand as well.
Perfect. Actually, no, they look too cool because they're the Undertaker's old gloves. Is it just gloves? Oh, perfect. Yes, looking good. Copy. Boom. Yes. All right, trunks. No, no, no belt. No socks. No shoes. Let's have a look what trunks. What do we want? Dude, I fill them out. I'm packing serious heat. Hmm. Oh, yes. True Brexit geezer. Let's get a different color. Let's get him in pink. Perfect. That is a true Brexit look, that is. He's on the way to the pub. Oh, we gotta get some shoes as well. Boots and shoes. Can't be walking around in bare feet, it's bad for you. Yo, they look kinda good. All those. The one thing I... Oh, yes, dude. <laughs> yes. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. Perfect. True Brexit geezer. The one thing I will say about this, um, the creator character is, like, very impressive. These used to be, like, really limited, but you can do lots of cool stuff now. Select Persona. Oh, this is just, like, the same thing. No, I don't want that. Yo, we got our Atea sorted. Yes, what a boy. Ring attire, entrance. Oh, it's, that's just, like, different ones. Personal information. Name information. Name. Wait, I'm trying to type. I not type with the keyboard? Oh my god, I gotta fucking do this. Ning, uh, name? King? Not Ning, King. Use his name for your abbreviated name? Uh, sure, King. That's my abbreviated name. King, sure. <laughs> I was gonna put King Eben, but King will do. Social name, account name, at King. That's it. Nickname, the superstar. Uh, the super athlete. Yep, that's me. I mean, look at me. I'm an, obviously a super athlete. Custom images? I don't have any. Menu screen pose. Oh, look at him showing his ass. What a boy. Set all. Yo, I kind of like that one. Oh, that one. Slay Queen. There's so many of them. Dude, this is going to take me like all hour to find a <laughs> find ones that I want. Hmm. These ones are not slaying enough. Oh, yes. Look at him. His hand, his hands disappear into his stomach fat. That is legendary. Done. Crowd reaction, they've got a cheer. 100%. Personality traits, egotistical or prideful. I mean, he's egotistical. Look at him. Egotistical, but respectful. Desperate. And a little bit treacherous. You never know. He's bold though, because he's a he's a he's a hero. And aggressive. There we go. Hometown. Hometown, Switzerland. Where's United Kingdom? 
You can do Wales. Okay, I guess I guess I need to do England specifically. Where is he from? Up north. England. Alright, what can we choose? Birmingham, Blackpool, Chelsea, Dudley, Grades, Leeds, London, Manchester, Newcastle, Norwich, Preston, Wolverhampton. You you guys get Birmingham and Wolverhampton, but all we get in Yorkshire is fucking Leeds. Alright, I guess I'm from Leeds. That's the closest. Closest one. Crowd signs USA. Absolutely. Uh, let's see what else we've got. I raised Kane. Let's get some generic ones. I don't want some... Oh, I don't have any. Custom? Oh, you can just make one. Oh, dude, I want to add a custom image. King of Kings. True, true, true. Hold on. King of Kings. Yes, that is such a good one. Yo, right now, thanks for the thanks for the raid, man. Just draw a dick, dude. That is so immature of you. Oh, the, those Hulkamania signs. There's Eddie Guerrero ones, which is cool. Rey Mysterio ones. Lita, thank you, Trish. Lashley. Every man has a price. There's even like million dollar man's ones stuff in here. Yo, Chasm Co, welcome. HBK. The headline of the showstopper in the main event. Stephanie is amazing. Welcome to the queendom. Absolutely. Dude, again, there are so many of these. Long live the king. I was waiting for the, the Jerry, Lulling, Jerry the King Lola ones. There we go. USA, King of Kings, welcome to the Queendom and long live the king. Perfect. Side plates? What is a side plate? Oh, are these like custom ones if you get like a title or something? I don't know what these are. Uh, they all have like loads of custom ones. The plates on the world title. Yeah. Uh... I think it'd be kind of weird to have like a Damien Priest one on there. Wait, it's just, okay. Live all like this one. There you go. Now she can feel involved. If she ever sees this one. Weight class. Oh, I mean, we already looked at that one. Fighting style. Uh, striker, technician. I mean, I have to be a powerhouse, right? No, high flyer. I'm a high flyer. Uh, attributes. Wait, will this reset me to... I can't be a super heavyweight? No, I don't think so. I think I can. Override any custom trades you made to attributes, movesets. Yeah, I think I can be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Stats. Attributes overall. Wait, it's actually going to take forever. No mind. 79. 80 will do. Payback. I don't know what these are. This will do. Right, let's get moving. We're going to do some matches. Yes. Continue. I would go 100 uh, everything, but we've got we've to do some matches. Uh, no, I don't care about uploading it to this thing. Uh, let's go. Where would we? Where did we go? Where else was it? Uh, home. My rise. Yeah, skip this. Uh, select import superstar. The king. Let's go. Yes. King, the high flyer. All right, we're in. It only took forty minutes. Welcome to the bump and what is shaping up to be the most chaotic summer slam Byron Saxton. I hate his ass. I'm Byron Saxton. And I'm Fuck Caleb you, Braxton. Less than a week before defending the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against Cody Rhodes in a brand versus brand main event at SummerSlam, 
Roman Reigns shocked the world and surrendered his title. The head of the <sighs> table said that he's been beating up Cody for years now, and he has nothing more to prove. Now he's taking a sabbatical in Hollywood to show his cousin, The Rock, that he will be a bigger superstar there, too. With SummerSlam in disarray and the draft set to begin the night after. Triple H called for a one-night WWE Universal title tournament with selections from the GMs of both Raw and SmackDown. Raw GM William Regal named Cody Roman Ross steps down in the entirety of WWE, he just goes into shambles. I love it. Coming to Raw. But SmackDown's brand new general manager, The Miz, didn't find this awesome. He called the attempt to take his WWE Universal Championship to Raw nothing short of theft. And The Miz is in it to win it for his brand. He's sending a team of killers to bring that title home. Let's take a look. Kayla, we know what Braun Strowman brings to a fight. AJ Styles is always a threat. I'm fighting Kevin Eno, Owens to start Eno off is with. The man to beat in this whole Bruh. tournament. He's been hungry for the opportunity. Reigns has left him here. That sounds like he was waiting for crumbs from Roman's table, Byron. William Regal's entries are no slouches. Finn Balor was the first Universal Champion. Much of the WWE Universe believes this is Gunter's time, and Cody Rhodes has been looking to finish the story for a while now. The ring better not break. That last slot, though, Kayla. What is Regal's strategy there? William Regal still has one foot in developing young superstars. Raw's GM is going to make a match on the SummerSlam kickoff show for that last slot in the tournament. Your guy, Kevin Owens. I mean, I wouldn't call him my guy. Your guy is not going to know his opponent until the winner of that match, and neither will we. I love the old, uh, like, women's belts and the ECW titles and stuff in there. I'm surprised they still show those titles. Usually they don't. Okay, at 12.53 days... Oh, I thought this was, like, an infographic, but it's just, like, shilling Roman to me. <laughs> oh, look at the king! Look at him speed! This guy's nuts. Don't blow yourself up, young man. You're apt to have a long night. Mr. Regal. Coming in early to help the ring crew, running the ropes while everyone else is still at the hotel, it makes an impression. Thanks. I do my best. Do you? What do you mean? Do you do your best? Apply yourself. You sound like my old math teacher. Well, you came to Raw more than a year ago now. Already guessed. And you've yet to make much of an impression. No titles, no great rivalries, a win-loss record with just enough victories to fly under the radar. A uh, great pep talk? Let me finish. I Should I go in a British accent? I don't, I don't know if I could. Is, I might have been able to, if you're ready to fulfill I kind of rushed to the end. I'm ready. Good. Yeah, weirdest you know, lead accent. There's yeah. a tournament for the Leads. WWE Universal Championship tonight. The final slot for Raw will be decided in a match on the kickoff show. One of the combatants will be Dominic Mysterio. That young man has a future, a legacy, a name. The other competitor is you. I'm fighting Dominic Mysterio. Thank you, sir. So much. The last I remember Dominic Mysterio... Um, Rey Mysterio and Eddie Guerrero were fighting over custody of him in a ladder match. And now he's like a legitimate competitor in WWE. You're the dark so weird. Beat the odds. His belly went through the rope? I didn't see that. Epic. Straight back to running. He's on the grind set. Dominic literally turned emo cringe lord at Simpsonia Ripley based. Dude, is every single loading screen just shilling Roman Reigns' title run to me? Oh, social feed. The real dark horse is Cody Rhodes. How is Cody Rhodes a dark horse? How do I check my DMs? I don't think I can. Social media provides another way to engage in stories. Social media posts appear in your social media feed. Oh, I haven't got any DMs. I think that's why. Uh, you can also filter your SM and DM feeds by s which posts lead directly to stories. Some social media and DMs are just comments on your superstar and stories and won't lead to a new story. Okay. Similar to superstars within the hub, you will notice an optional 
icon next to various social media posts and direct messages that lead to optional stories. Okay. So these are all just random stuff. I don't think any of these have a story for me. And I have DM from William Regal. Remember what I said? It doesn't matter what you've done up until this point. You can make your impression tonight. Give it your best shot and there's no telling how far you'll go. Okay. Hub menu. So right, my rise hub menu. In addition to using this menu to social media for storyline opportunities, this is where you can customize your look, entrances, and upgrade your attributes. But I just want to fight. Victory. Appearance, entrance, moveset, victory. I press that button. I'm a simple man. Victory. Oh, it 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 uh, it's just to customize what happens when you win. Bro, I want to I want to fight. Let me progress. Okay, here we go. This is the Myra's hub. Uh, yeah. Okay. Icons next to each superstar in the hub will tell you whether a story is a must-play story, an optional story, or a challenge match. I'm gonna go through the main path story quickly, focus on the must-play. Okay. Troy Simpkin. The Miz. I don't see either of those logos. What does Troy have to say? Oh, good. There you are. I'm Troy Simpkin. Associate, but soon to be full-fledged producer. Okay. Uh, Troy, we've met several times. You even borrowed my toothbrush once. Okay. <laughs> Ribbing you, bro. Anyway, just wanted to make sure you had the lay of the land. I mean, yeah, yeah, blah, blah. blah. I know how these things work. For a while now, I know how these okay, things. Okay, fine. But thanks. Let me fight. To... Good idea. Since the kickoff show. Why would I go back to the hotel? Of course. Yep. Hello, Miz. Well, look who it is. If it isn't SummerSlam's dark horse. Uh, that that uh, lip syncing is just that nickname incredible. Sticking. Good times. Good times is Raw trying to steal SmackDown's WWE Universal title. Between us, what is Regal really up to? Who isn't the dark horse? Yeah, I thought Cody Rhodes was a dark horse, but apparently I am. Um, giving me an opportunity. He to put you in a qualifying match. You think that's some kind of I'm not? What do you? Getting? You know he has all his royal eggs in the Cody Rhodes basket. He's just yeah, okay, oh, dude. post about me for real. Why would you? Because want I want the WWE Universal Title on my show, where it belongs, and I am one. You've inspired me. You have invoked the law of unintended consequences. See, you're thinking maybe I throw this guy a bone. My guy Owens gets an easy first fight, but what you've done instead is inspire me. Wow, what a line. <laughs> Is that right? See, I was looking to make it into the tournament and show the WWE Universe what I really got. But now, now, I'm looking to go all the way just so I can take that championship away from you, you condescending reality show hack. Wow. You will never be champion, and you will never appear on SmackDown. Miz is like yelling at me, but his character is like smiling. <laughs> the, the characters have like no emotion whatsoever. Okay, go to match. Is that all we can do? I think so. Let's go to the match. Roman Reigns. He's so great. I know. All right. It's the so-called dark horse of the tournament. The crowd looks as good as they did 15 years ago. The following contest is a qualifying match for the Universal... Why are all the loading screens Roman Reigns? You're asking me. Making his way to the ring from Leeds, England, weighing in at 600 pounds. 600 Bro, and I'm doing... I'm flipping about. Let's not get ahead of ourselves calling this guy the dark horse of the tournament. He's not even officially in it yet. I have to agree with you, Corey. Winning the WWE Universal Weighing it at 600 pounds, I'm doing like front flips and handsprings and shit. To have to win an extra qualifying match first makes it nearly impossible.
Dominic does not look geared to, to fight. Just got back wise Ben's character Andre the Giant on acid. You will treat my character with respect. Quickest way to sabotage your own chances. Dom needs to put aside his grievances and concentrate on the task at hand. Just a random booze. <laughs> Ooh. In a moment that can define a career, the road to glory begins right here. Does Michael Cole still commentate? Yeah, I think I can see him over there. Michael Cole, what a boy. All right, let's do it. This is not even close. Look at the size of me in and look at the size of him. Dude, look, I'm cracked. Oh, dude, I'm nuts. I am fucking absolutely dominating this guy. Look at my fucking moveset. <laughs> Oh, it's not even close. It's already over. I've already killed him. Oh, he caught me. How do I reverse? Get him. Yeah, back down you go. Back down you go, Dom. Y'all trash. Get down you go, Dom. Yeah, I'm like five times the size of him. How do I sprint? <laughs> Dude, I'm just messing this guy up. It's like not even close. He just keeps reversing me, but then I just kick him down again. No, he dodged! How do I reverse? No! Instant recovery! Never mind, I'm sick! Oh, he's going down again! <laughs> what am I even doing here? He reversed it. How do I reverse? The tutorial didn't teach me. Oh, I'm, I'm out. Help. He's still mashed to get up. Rose fly. I'm dead. I'm up. Never mind. It's over. I'm going to get his ass. No. How the fuck do I reverse things? Bro, what are the controls? Uh, controls. How do I reverse? Why? Of course. Wait, I'm too late. Shit. No, I'm gonna get counted out in my first match. Get up. Yeah, fuck you. Uh, reversal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna win by count out. Check this. There we go. Get in. How do I go in? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Count him out. Need to hustle back. Just a few seconds left. No. No. Fuck. That was close. Get back out the ring. Fuck you, dumb. Oh, shit. I'm nuts. <laughs> that that backflip is so fucking sick. This match could still go either way. Oh. <laughs> You have solidified your name as a top athlete. Come here, Dom. You're able to pull off that move. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Dude, I'm actually so cracked. Arm ringer in control. What is he doing? He's controlling my ass. Get him. 
Yeah. Ooh, and a shot to the body and another. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Get up. Go on the other side of the Yeah. Yeah. Backflip. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was unlucky. <laughs> Woo! No! I'm getting beat up. Kill him! <laughs> Instant recovery, get him! <laughs> if Ray Mysterio was two meters tall and 300 kilos. Legit. No! Yeah, I'm too big, you can't even take me down. Down he goes. Charge finisher. Wait, it said I could do that. Like R B and A or something. R T and A, I think. I'm gonna finish her him. Get up. Uh oh, watch out. No, I'm losing. Got him. Charge finisher. No. I'm losing. Oh, you back right mass. Yeah, fuck off, Dom. Charge finisher! Pin! I've got him! I've got him! Against a grounded opponent, press down to pin them in most match types. While getting pinned, you can do it with the mini. Nah, I've already won. It's over. Nah! He kicked out! What a hacker! I've got a comeback move! Comeback move! Let me do it again. I can't reverse anymore. I'm too beaten up, I think. Oh, no, I can. Come back, move. Hit him again. Rope break. Fuck. Get up. Come back, move. Yeah! Wait, it's a fucking QTE. I didn't know that. Shit! No! <laughs> I'm not backing it. I'm getting beaten up. Oh, no, man. I'm smurfing. Bro, every time I go to do like a grapple there, I just like fail. I think I need to press another button or something. There we go. What am I doing now? Oh, sure. Yeah. I'm going up again. Moon Soul. Get him. No. <laughs> He's pinning me. How do I reverse? Yeah, no. yeah easy, noobs. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Get him! Yeah! Right Get him again! No Get him again! <laughs> come back, move! No, I win again. Sure. Do I have a finish yet? I do. And Dominic could be moments away from Doom. Pin again. And that could be all. Let's see. There's two. Let's go. Suck it, Dominic. Suck it. I'm a beast. How tall am I? Seven foot. Easy. Look at me. I am clean. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Look at me. That's the final thing you see before I come and run in her crown of your ass. <laughs> oh, dear.
Dude looks like unbaked clay, but he moves like an angel. True. True, true, true. Play messages. I have a DM. Yeah, shut up. Uh, but yeah, so <laughs> that's WWE 2K24. We have 90 seconds left on the hour, so not quite time for another match, I don't think. Uh, Cody Rhodes is there, and Kevin Owens as well, but uh, no time, sadly. Uh, but yeah, overall thoughts. Um, gameplay, fun. Graphics, they, they still see the same as they were like 10 years ago, I swear. Like, we, we've made like no graphical improvements to these games in so long. Like, you, you have games that come out that look as good as some AAA games do nowadays, and then you had The Miz who was like shouting, but he looked like he was talking, and there was no lip syncing or anything. Like, the, the graphics are so far behind in terms of how AAA games usually look. But the gameplay is fun, the controls feel fine. The create a, a character is really good. It has like a ton of really cool options that you can do. And you can customize like pretty much anything. Um, yeah, the actually getting the game to capture was really annoying because you it's really hard to find the settings, which for a PC game is pretty stupid. Like fair enough if it's a console game, you probably aren't gonna wanna change much. But like having these buried like this is really stupid in my opinion. Like if you go to options, it should be graphics in here. Like why in options is there is there the first button the store? I mean, I know why that is. Of course, it's because it's a, you know, currency premium game or whatever. You can buy a load of crap from the store, but yeah. Uh, but yeah, thanks, thanks for joining me. Um, it's my hour up. Let me end the tracking for it so I don't forget. Because I have done a bounty before where I just forgot to start the thing. And uh, yeah, didn't, get, didn't, didn't, didn't actually count it. So I kind of stole the game from them, which is my bad. Uh, exit. There we go. Tracking done. Perfect. I fully expect the performance center to be graphics options. Yeah, very much true. Yeah, you would think that that was probably the, um, where you would look at the performance, right? Like the PC performance. That, that makes sense. But, yeah. The only reason I knew is because, uh, obviously performance center, I knew it from watching WWE off being familiar with it. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much for joining. Um, next stream, as I say, will be uh, more GTA stuff. We'll be back to it, and the next casual game. Uh, after we'll do we'll do Half Life DLC, and then we'll be doing Bully afterwards. So stay tuned for that. But I appreciate you all coming in, and uh, yeah, I'll see you next week. Have a good rest of your weekend if you if you're still, uh, you know, still got things to do, still got plans to. Plans to, what's the word? Plans to, I was going to say achieve, but that's not correct. Plan, plans to initiate. Uh, but yeah, thanks for joining. I'll see you all next time. Have a good rest of your weekend. See you next week. Bye-bye.